Logan, I guess, first off, what's it like to have your, your dad back here and, and helping with the staff? Uh, well, it's pretty good for me because, I mean, I grew up with him. Like, he taught me how to play baseball. So having him here around, um, I think it's really going to help me offensively and really all parts of my game. I mean, it's just kind of going back to my roots and, like, where I learned to play. So, How, how much has he really mentored your game since, you you know, your, your freshman season last year here at Clemson? Um, well, that was minimized because we lived three hours away. But now that he's here, you know, it's everyday occurrence. So, like, I'm... I think it's really helped me a lot with my swing and pretty much everything, honestly. After a good freshman year for you last year, what are some of the things you learned over the past year that you're now going to you know, try to teach some of the younger guys? Uh, well, I made a lot of mistakes, and I learned from those mistakes. I had a lot of time on the field, a lot of experience here and in summer ball. I think it was somewhere like 100 and 510 games. So it was just, it was a lot of experience on the field. I learned a lot of things, and it was kind of, try to relate that to the newcomers and try to help them not make those mistakes. Are you the kind of guy that says, hey, I had a fantastic freshman season, or I've got to work on defense, base running, hitting in clutch situations? Right. Yeah, definitely, which side is it? Definitely the second guy. I mean, it was, I'm not complaining about last season, but I mean, there's definitely a lot of improvements I need to make in all aspects. You know, hitting, stealing bags, in the field, whatever it is, there's a lot of a lot of things I need to improve on, and that's what I'm going to do this fall. So. Can you talk to us a little bit about your, your summer league season and who you played for and some of the players that you played with? Well, I played in Cape Cod with Falmouth, the uh, Falmouth Commodores. Uh, it, was, it was really fun. We had a great group of guys up there. Um, I think for me, it was more just kind of learning the struggles of playing every day, like in and out every day, being in the field all day. It's more like a professional lifestyle. Um, you know, show up in the field around lunchtime and you don't leave until 10 every day, ever and ever and ever. So learning those struggles was hard for me at first, but I think I started to get used to it at the end of the season. So I think it was good for me. Wooden bat. Yes, wooden bat. Yeah, What's it like swinging that wooden bat? Really, um, probably maybe for the first time in your life. Oh, uh, well, the first, I mean, we do it every tournament so when you're younger, but it's nothing like that doing it every day. But I think, I think the first two weeks, I would say, two or three weeks, it took a while to get used to it just from, you know, something that, you get jammed on breaks your bat instead of maybe floating over the second baseman's head or whatever it may be. But I think after the first couple of weeks, you settle in with the right bat. That, that, that's kind of a really prestigious summer league. Um, how, how much of a dream of it was, of yours was it to play in that league? And uh, you know, what were some of your experiences up there? Uh, well, it was pretty exciting when I first found out because I found out in the fall. Like, I knew I was going up there, but I didn't really know what to expect. Like, I'd never been through a summer ball, a collegiate summer ball. But I talked with, you know, Charlie Barnes last year and who else was up there, Alex Eubanks. Brooks Crawford was up there, so I talked to them and kind of learned like what their experience was like. And hopefully now I can kind of pass mine on to the freshmen that are going up there next year. And it's exciting for them too. So, what do you look to get out of fall camp this year? Um, well, personally, like I said earlier, it's just gonna kind of develop my game in all aspects. You know, I mean, get faster, get better at hitting, get better at feeling, all that stuff. Work on my little things. And as a team, I mean, obviously we got a lot of new guys coming in a lot of talent so we were hopefully we can see how they're gonna play out. Uh, hopefully I can help them and teach them some of my some of my experience and some of my learn from my mistakes. So you, you had a pretty respectable performance in the home run derby uh, out in Omaha. Can you tell us what that, that experience was like? <laughs> that was awesome. That was experience of a lifetime to be honest. I was I'm really glad I did that. Uh, it was just a lot of fun to be out there to be honest with you. You get kind of a lay of the land in case you all make it back there next season. Oh yeah that would be really nice. Hopefully next time I'm out there it's with these guys. Uh. Thanks, Logan.